Lord, open our lips, and we shall praise your name. The Lord is the King of virgins, come let us adore him. The Lord is the King of virgins, come let us adore him. Come ring it our joy to the Lord. Hail the God who saves us. Let us come before him giving thanks. With songs let us hail the Lord. The Lord is the King of virgins. Come let us adore him. A mighty God is the Lord. A great King above all gods. In his hand the depths of the earth, the heights of the mountains are his. To him belongs the sea, for he made it, and the dry land shaped by his hands. The Lord is the King of virgins, come let us adore him. Come in, let us bow and bend low. Let us kneel before the God who made us. For he is our God and we, the people who belong to his pasture, the flock that is led by his hand. The Lord is the King of virgins, come let us adore him. Oh, that today you would listen to his voice. Harden not your hearts as at Meribah, as on that day at Mass or in the desert, when your fathers put me to the test, when they tried me, though they saw my word. The Lord is the King of virgins, come let us adore him. For forty years I was weird of these people, and I said their hearts were astray. These people do not know my ways. Then I took an oath in my anger, never shall they enter my rest. The Lord is the King of virgins, come let us adore him. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. The Lord is the King of virgins. Come, let us adore Him. For all thy saints, O Lord, who strove in thee to live, who followed thee, obeyed, adored, our grateful him receive. They all in life and death, with thee their Lord in view, learn from the Holy Spirit's breath to suffer and to do. For this thy name we bless, and humbly beg that we may follow them in holiness, and live and die in thee. Give joy to your servant, Lord, for to you I lift up my soul. Turn your ear, O Lord, and give answer. For I am poor and needy. Preserve my life, for I am faithful. Save the servant who trusts in you. You are my God, have mercy, me, Lord. For I cry to you all the day long. Give joy to your servant, O Lord. For to you I lift my soul. O Lord, you are good and forgiving, full of love to all who call. Give heed, O Lord, to my prayer, and attend to the sound of my voice. In the day of distress I will call, and surely you will reply. 
among the gods there is none like you, O Lord, no work to compare with yours. All the nations shall come to adore you, and glorify your name, O Lord. For you are great and do marvellous deeds, you who alone are God. Show me, Lord, your way, so that I may walk in your truth. Guide my heart to fear your name. I will praise you, Lord my God, with all my heart, and glorify your name forever. For your love to me has been great. You have saved me from the depths of the grave. The proud have risen against me. Ruthless men seek my life. To you they pay no heed. But you, God of mercy and compassion, slow to anger, O Lord, abounding in love and truth, turn and take pity on me. O give your strength to your servant, and save your handmaid son. Show me a sign of your favour, that my foes may see to their shame, that you console me and give me your help. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Give joy to your servant, Lord, for to you I lift up my soul. Blessed is the man who walks in justice and speaks what is true. Hear you who are far off what I have done, and you who are near acknowledge my might. The sinners in Zion are afraid, trembling as seize the godless, who among us can dwell with the devouring fire, who among us can dwell with everlasting burnings. He who walks righteously and speaks uprightly, who despises the gain of oppressions, who shakes his hands lest they hold a bribe, and stops his ears from hearing of bloodshed, and shuts his eyes from looking upon evil. He will dwell in the heights. His place of defence will be the fortresses of rocks. His bread will be given him. His water will be sure. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Blessed is the man who walks in justice and speaks what is true. Acclaim the King, the Lord. Sing a new song to the Lord, for his work wonders, his right hand and his holy arm have brought salvation. The Lord has made known his salvation, has shown his justice to the nations, he has remembered his truth and love for the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God. Shout to the Lord, all the earth, ring out your joy. Sing psalms to the Lord with a harp, with a sound of music. With trumpets and the sound of the horn, acclaim the King, the Lord. Let the sea and all within it thunder, the world and all its peoples. Let the rivers clap their hands, and the hills ring out their joy. Rejoice at the presence of the Lord, for he comes to rule the earth. He will rule the world with justice, and the peoples with fairness. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, 
both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come, at the end of the ages. Acclaim the King, the Lord. Love is a fire, no waters avail to, quen to quench, no floods to drown. For love a man would give up all he has in the world and think nothing of his loss. My heart has said of you, I have sought your presence, Lord. My heart has said of you, I have sought your presence, Lord. It is your face that I will continue to seek. My heart has said of you, I have sought your presence, Lord. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. My heart has said of you, I have sought your presence, Lord. See, the wise virgin has gone to Christ. She shines among the choirs of virgins, like the sun in the heavens. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Saviour in the house of David his servant as he promised by the lips of holy men, those who were his prophets from of old, a saviour who would freeze from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us, so his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father to grant us that free from fear and save from the hands of our foes we might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him, to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. See, the wise virgin has gone to Christ. She shines among the choirs of virgins, like the sun in the heavens. With great joy, let us praise Christ, the bridegroom of all virgins. Jesus, crown of virgins, hear us. Lord Jesus, the holy virgins loved you as their only spouse. May we never be separated from you. Jesus, crown of virgins, hear us. You crowned your mother Mary as queen of all virgins. By her prayers, grant that we may serve you in purity of life. Jesus, crown of virgins, hear us. The holy virgins followed you with undivided hearts. Do not allow us to be fascinated by this passing world and drawn away from you. Jesus, crown of virgins, hear us. Lord Jesus, you are the bridegroom that the wise virgins were ready to meet. Let us watch for your coming with longing and hope. 
Jesus, crown of virgins, hear us. May Saint Clare, who reigns in your kingdom, intercede for us. Through her prayers, grant us wisdom and innocence of life. Jesus, crown of virgins, hear us. At the Saviour's command, and form by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord God, in your mercy, you led St. Clair to the life of poverty. Help us by her intercession to follow Christ in poverty of spirit, so that in the kingdom of heaven we may see you in your glory. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.